Well, thank you. I, I know he'd appreciate that if he were here. But he's in the shower. He's going on an interview this morning to... Who's in the shower? Anybody in the shower? Uh, quiet. What do you mean, in the shower? Dad, would you please tell him to be quiet? I say he's going on an interview this morning to see Mr. Mo Litbach, the president of the Irish Woolen Mill. Mo Litbach, president of the Irish Woolen Mills? Please. She says he's negotiating with the Irish Woolen Mills Limited. Offer him $75 a week and tell his daughter to get in touch with him immediately. <clears throat> uh, Mr. Malloy has just informed me that uh, on account of his long association with your father, uh, he can offer $75 a week. Well, I don't think that would be adequate. I know that he's considering an offer of um, $100 a week with four weeks vacation at full pay. The Irish Willow Mills have offered him $100 a week and four weeks holiday on full salary. Offer him the same, but have him report here in the morning. How can he report in the morning if you're going to give him a four week holiday? Dash. 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 All right. We'll meet the offer, but at the end of the four weeks, I want him here on the job. Uh, Mr. Malloy will meet the offer. No, I was thinking I'd do. What, Dad? I thought I'd get down to the um, farm and tell them that um, I work for less money. Uh, Miss Claude and Mrs. Nestle Road aren't living with us, and our expenses aren't so high. Well, so, as a matter of fact, I thought that I was so busy cooking I forgot to tell you that your firm wants you back at your old job. At $100 a week, with a four-week vacation, at full pay and in advance. I'm sorry I wasn't here, dear. I'd have told him I wanted $200 a week, a six-month vacation, and full pay. I want that paper to wrap up these belongings of Ambrose. The weather's turning cold now, and I want to take his underwear and socks oh, over to him. I think you're a perfect fool. You don't let him come and get him himself. Please let me do things in my own way and hand me that paper. You take that paper, he's sure to wake up. You'd better stir yourself and go into town and look for a job. This is just a lot of nonsense. <coughs> Taking a nap every morning oh, after breakfast. Bad, yeah. Dad, cover up. You'll catch more cold. Leave me alone, Ma. I do believe you're still in love with that old fool. That's a fine thing for you to call him. After he went out of his way to invite you and Claude to go for a ride in his new car tomorrow. I'll be back later. It's beginning to rain. 